Hey everyone, it's Selena here at Amore Fabrics. Welcome back. It's been a while. I think I've been away from work for about a month. If you're new here, this is a crafty channel that not only do I do shop shares, I share my shop with some new products in my shop. Um, I am working on a few different things. I know spring and summertime is here coming and um, should I say spring is here and summertime is coming. <laughs> Um, I'm hoping to do uh, get back into junk in my trunk for those who don't know what that is. That is usually when I go to state sales and I'm garaging and thrifting and, and uh, just going to different states and, and finding some really cool stuff and it's called junk in my trunk. Um, and I do videos and you guys pretty much could pick what you like and first come first serve and I throw stuff in the shop and then daily deals. <laughs> I'm rambling now. Anyway, so that's what Junk in My Trunk is all about. Um, but right now, I'm back in the shop. Um, I didn't add anything new, so it's just what's stocked is usually stocked. Right now, this week, I was hoping to just do Etsy shop shares. I have a list of people that I wanted to share. Uh, those who don't know, I've been away for medical reasons. Um, I'm back. I'm healthy, and I'm ready to get back into it. Um, but during the time I was gone, I had a bunch of wonderful uh, shops and friends and had, who just praised me with a bunch of beautiful things. And of course, I did a bunch of shopping. Um, there's a lot of shops that I shopped with. Um, a few years back, I used to do weekly uh, Etsy shop shares. Um, I stopped doing that for various reasons. But I wanted to pick that back up again in moderation because sometimes that can consume you. And I want to share shops and everything. But... Um, um, it just, just takes over a lot of time, and I have a shop to run, and I want to praise all these new Etsy shop owners and um, and all this, and my goal is to do that in moderation. So let's, let's patience with me as I do that, um, but I do hope you guys check out these Etsy shops that I'm going to be sharing this week. Um, a lot of them are trust. A lot of them are friends. Um, a lot of them um, are, like I said, a lot of small businesses where they struggle and they want to get out there and to be noticed. And this is what we do. We're supposed to help share each other. So right now, today, I'm going to share Kay. Hi, Kay, if you're watching this. Kay um, is in New York City. Um, and she's got an Etsy shop, uh, Kay Art in the City. She also sells Avon. So after I show you what she custom made for me, this is a journal she custom made for me. For those who have a loss of a pet. Or you want to uh, to uh, create a journal that is customized for a pet that is alive, that is. But in this case, this is a pet of mine, Mr. Nixon, which is right here. I'll tell you guys a little bit about him. This is going to be quite of a long video. So bear with me. Be patient. I'm going to give you a little bit about my pet, Nixon. But mainly the goal in this video is to show you and showcase what Kay had did. Um, I'm going to flip through really quick what she does and creates. She does these custom orders for those in memory of a lost pet or, um, or or just a memory of your pet that is, like I said, alive today. It's, it could be a various ways. But in this case, my poor Nixon. But I will go over that in a little bit. I feel like I've been rambling here. Um, usually I'm pretty good with videos, but I guess a month away can really get you. <laughs> But those who know about Avon, I'll quickly touch base on that here in a second, uh, they have really changed. Um, I'm pretty shocked um, that, you know, before, you know, if anyone's ever ordered from Avon before, there was a time there um, that they just kind of got stopped doing the, the cool gifts and, and their products were just okay. And um, now that I've been ordering from her, I've been getting a lot of goodies and I want to share that with you. But first and foremost, Kay are in the city. Of course, she's from New York City. She is a wonderful, dear friend of mine. I reached out to her, actually. I noticed that she was doing these journals, like I says, said, says, oh my goodness, my brain today. I'm still working on coffee, and I got a little bit of a sore throat. Um, go figure, right? You go through major surgery, and then you get a sore throat. <laughs> So um, I'll quickly go through it really uh, quick here. She wrapped it um, and with this beautiful like a uh, ribbon here. Um, I reached out to her because um, Mr. Nixon has been a foster pet that we got and then we end up adopting him. He's like a little mama dog. He passed away a few years ago and um, she creates these uh, journals that are, look at, I guess I should just show you. But um, I seen this color and I wanted this journal because this is Nixon's colors. He was a black dog and he was at a shelter. And, you know, those who know most black dogs are not 
rescued because of the color. It sounds sad, but true, which I'm not even going to go there. But um, he, he looked mean. He was only six months old, um, and he was used um, poorly, and they were going to euthanize him that week. And I said, no, I'm going to take him. I'll foster him. I will love him, and I will bring him in our house and, and hopefully adopt him, but hopefully just get him around loving people and other animals because we were fostering at the time a bunch of other puppies and things like that and he was perfect but um i'll go more into about him here in, at the end of the video so but first and foremost let's i want to showcase her <clears throat> and not cry about my dog <laughs> so she, i wanted this journal cover because nixon black and red was his colors like for sure and um nixon his name by the way is the name he got at birth and so we kept the name nixon and it was just totally him but what really got me, not only was the color, is just how she does, how, how she has done the journals itself. I've already started customizing this for my husband. This is a gift for him. It's a surprise. And I know it's really going to get him. So there's some things I've actually started in this as well. My husband's name's Donald. <laughs> and uh, but it's just, look at the pages. I've already paper clipped. She put these things in here. She had, uh, don't cry for me. And it's about a pet and, oh my goodness, I already cried reading it. <clears throat> Thank you, Kay. Um, but a, a paper clip accidentally another page here. But I wanted to show you the pages. It was just perfect. It was cardstock type papers and it's just perfect to write on and customize to be your own. These here weren't from her. These here actually, uh, before Nixon passed away, we had to put them asleep. These are, the hospital had done this for us, but they did like a nose print and a paw print which was so special, and I'm not going to cry. I'm just going to turn that page. <clears throat> and uh, so that, uh, uh, so I just want to show you the pages really quick. <clears throat> that what Kate did. She did customize it very minimally, which I'm glad because she gives it room for you to journal. And look at these cards. She had sewn these cards together. They're like for these belly band, right, Kay? <clears throat> and uh, put it in here. Look how cute that is. Um, and I just wanted to show you guys the pages and it's just perfect. If you guys need the measurements, the measurement will be down below for you guys. Um, another one of those beautiful cards she put in here and she's sewn around the edges. It's just, it's just beautiful. Look at that. Oh my God. Oh my God. Isn't that beautiful? Okay. <clears throat> Moving on. So look at all this room to customize. Look at how cute this is. Oh, wait. This, I didn't even realize. Look at this. It's magnetized. She had put in there little mini magnets. And it makes this like a little book to where you can put, um, oh my goodness, this is a pocket. Oops, sorry. I should bring it down. I'm like holding it so close that I'm looking at it for myself. <laughs> sorry, guys. And so that magnetizes. Oh my gosh, that is such a cute idea. How cool is that? And you can put pictures. She made it. I told her I wanted it to where I can put some pictures and stuff like that in here. And I'm going to do that for my husband. And it's going to be a gift for him. So shh, let's not tell him. Um, but look at the pages. Aren't they just gorgeous? I just set up my camera today. I haven't. I feel so bad. Look at the cute. like little mason jars. I got to figure out what my camera is now. I uh, changed my camera settings and everything. And Hope it's not zoom in. It is a rainy day today, so lighting's pretty bad too. It's a mason jar. Look at the cute little cookies in there. And then it's, it's sewn around there. Look how cute. What a cute idea. The corner pockets. This is the envelope from the other side. A good, great tuck for something to put in there. And there's the envelope. Look at that. How cool. And this is a pocket as well. Yes, please. Down below is Kay's links to her shop. Look out here. You can make that like a, a, what do you call that? Film. Oh my goodness, guys, my brain today. Put a picture in there. Look at my best bud. That is so cool. Very well thought out. And she did it universal to where, you know, it was just for whatever kind of dog. But this is totally perfect for Nixon. And, uh, lots of pages to journal and I'm telling you it was so affordable as well if you reach out to her and say hey I want these certain colors this natch she just whips them up really good for you look at that and it's a fabric cover yep I can see my zoom and lighting going in and out sorry guys I have to work on that I haven't been doing videos as much as I should she did like the corner 
uh, things there. But there you guys have it. And, you know, I didn't even give her this photo. She had <clears throat> got this photo off of my website. Uh, and she found it and she put it in there and it says in loving memory of Nixon. And uh, if you guys can see that he's laying on his bed, I had taken all his uh, bandanas from when he was uh, to go in to get groomed. And I made a quilt out of all his bandanas for him. But he absolutely loved that bed. He laid on it just like that. But he was a Border Collie mix. He just had a lot of um, uh, issues. He did not like men, you know, and all those things. But he ended up becoming like a mama dog to all the fosters that we brought in um, to our home. And he was just one amazing dog. And I'm not going to go any more into that. I'm going <clears> to. <throat> anyway, so in it, she had a. She, I keep saying I'm not going to do it. I keep going back to it. I'm telling you, pets are just like, they bring so much love and joy to you in your life, and they're like family. So she had made these cute little journal cards, and she had stitched, again, of course, like here, them together, and look how cute they are. This is also little pieces to do, like, your photos, to case your photos onto the pages. Um, also, the, the, uh, the hospital that... Uh, um, when we put our dog asleep, had also made this cute little ornament um, that has this paw print in it that I was going to do for my husband and work on that. And then they put in a little bottle his hair, um, and I was going to let that dangle on the journal when I was done for my husband. But once I'm done, I figured I'll do a quick video for you guys and show you how I had finished um, this journal for my husband. Okay, on to Avon. So again, like I said, down below is Kay's links to not only your Etsy shop, but how to contact her on Avon. She also does um, live videos as well. But this here is not something I purchased. What I purchased is in my bathroom and I didn't bring it. <laughs> but I did buy a bunch of day and night skincare for as a, for as a you know, I'm in my 40s. So um, I needed something better for my skin going through the change of life, you know. But um, Avon has amazing line of products just for that. Well, if you're not sure what you, what kind of skin products you're needing and stuff like that, Kay also has like different like uh, links she'll send you to where there's like, a, they'll figure it out for you. Like you answer questions and it almost reminds me, you know, of those who do, uh, what is it? <clears throat> What is that? Mary Kay used to do that. Those who used to get Mary Kay products. But I find that a uh, Avon has stepped it up to where they not only provide you resources, but they are doing uh, like that, like Mary Kay would do. Help cater, help guide you to the right directions. Anyways, anytime you purchase things from her, she sends you a lot of gifts, a lot of samples and things of the new products. Um, lipsticks here that she always she has these personalized you know her own personalized uh, lipsticks and chapsticks and things like that she of course a beautiful card she sent me kind of glittery thank you Kay but she also sent me samples of different products and since I was indisposed because I was going through surgery and stuff she sent me a bunch of amazing literature as well the nice books that tells you about their products but look at that guys they've really stepped it up and, um, of course, as Avon's model, they always give a lot of gifts with certain purchases. So you got to look and see the incentives of that. She also does, um, has like her own little page to where you can shop through her. And if you have any questions on any of the products, she will, she's like so quick to message you right back. So please reach out to Kay for, and it looks like here, they also have home products. I meant to tell you guys. So then now they have home products. They also have products, which I had a water bottle that, was had like yucky stuff in it and they have like cleaning products for your certain water bottles for those who are like to drink a bunch of water like I do um and those who follow me on Facebook will see I had to do that post but look at see how they have reached out to different like home products as well so please reach out to Kay um I hope you like I said support a small business oh yeah I'm sorry she sent me this too oh my goodness I've been wanting this in my shopping cart and I didn't get it. And we're friends, of course. She's not going to send everyone big whole products. But the more you know her and stuff like that, Kay is a big-hearted person. This was a great gift, Kay. Thank you so much for my special gift. This was a, a get well gift. And uh, But mind you, in her products, she does send you, like I said, a ton of samples. Which, me, I like having samples because I want to test it before I spend the money on certain things. And it's really nice. And, of course, this was 
a product too that she had gifted me and I thank you which I'm going to truly try that tonight for uh, the surgery that I have I can't take a bath up to four weeks which is like hard for me because I love baths and my bathtub rocks I have a really cool bathtub and uh, I'm a bath person so four weeks is killing me so I'm waiting for that day and I'm gonna can't wait please guys run over to Kay I hope I didn't like ramble too much um, and uh, give a thumbs up and please support Kay I thank you guys so much for the time for watching this video and support our small businesses you guys have a blessed day bye